Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, my name is Masood. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I wanted to make a sort of quarantine uh, special vlog. Um, I've recently been sort of furloughed by my job. So now I've got a little bit more spare time uh, on my hands at home uh, during this lockdown. If you're a new, sub if you're a new person watching my channel, uh, make sure to subscribe and hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. We're going to be making a lot more during this sort of lockdown period just going to be sharing a lot of uh you know cool moments anyway i uh, hope you enjoyed the video and uh yeah let's go all right guys so i've just brushed my teeth and i'm just gonna sort of have some breakfast um i've literally just made some scrambled egg with some vegetables and like some chocolate cake from yesterday. Uh, it was actually my birthday. So yeah, it was a bit weird having a birthday on quarantine because um, I was just stuck inside. But I did, I did go outside just for a little walk. Um, it was cool. And to be honest, um, I'm, I'm turn, I turned 26. So birthdays nowadays are getting to the point where like they, they're kind of not like that special. All right, so I've just had my breakfast and I am going to get changed. Really just put my hoodie on and then, uh, yeah, get ready. And then we're gonna go to the park. 12 seconds later. All right guys, so I just remembered, um, I've actually got a few things to do today. So uh, after we go to the park, I'm gonna take you guys to the park and then we're gonna have to sort of pick up some shoes that I'm selling. Uh, well, I need to post, so I need to sort of just package it up and then take it to the post office. And then I'll probably just take you guys through sort of um, what I do normally uh, when I'm just chilling. Yeah, so hope you enjoy it. So, uh, as you can tell from my dribbling, we've just made it to the park and I'm literally about to take a few shots now. So this is the park that I usually come to. Uh, it's called Elthorn Park, and it's literally right next to my house. Um, shouldn't be sharing that, um, but uh, yeah, I like it, really like it, because there's no people around, especially during quarantine, and it's very, very peaceful. So whenever you want to sort of get away and you know, you've got something going on in your life, you just come to the basketball court and just you know shoot. It's a shame though, because uh, uh, and, and I forgot to take a shit before leaving the house, so... <laughs> um, yeah, so we're probably not going to be staying here for too long. <laughs> Five minutes later. Alright guys, so uh, I think coming to the actual park has made me realise how unfit I actually am. Um, and I actually need to do some real exercise. So that's like actually running or jogging or something. Um, I think I've been relaxing too much, man. It's not good at all. I think I'm probably just gonna come back in the evening and maybe do like a little jog. Anyway, it's time to head back. I'm gonna go back now and uh, probably have a shower and then go and post a uh, package. Yeah. All right guys, just got back from the park. I came back to find this humongous daddy long legs just sitting here in my kitchen thinking it owns my house. Who does it think it is? Well, it's about to die. I'm really sorry for some of you guys who, uh, you know, believe in animal or insect cruelty. It's not going to be your day. Tissue's ready. It's actually just flown to like a different area. So I'm going to try and see if I can get it. What? It's flying everywhere, man. Oh my God. Kind of misjudged uh, my hand placement on the fly, and uh, you know I've taken down three of its legs. Now there is three more, but it still has wings, so it's just flying around everywhere. Um, and now it's just it's just stayed there. Now it's right there. Sorry you had to see that guys, but I had to protect my house. <laughs> All 
All right, guys. So I'm just on my way to the post office. I'm uh, gonna send off these these shoes. Right. Time to take that shower. Alright guys, so I've just come out of the shower, I feel like a new man, uh, time to get changed. And I'm gonna go upstairs now, and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna chill to be honest, <laughs> I'm not really gonna do much. Uh, yeah, just gonna go on my laptop and maybe just gonna show you guys my room. Alright, so we're back in my room now, and I'm just gonna show you around. It's quite small, it's not much to it, but um, it does a job. <laughs> so yeah, that's my bed, um, it's, un it's not done yet. And then uh, on my wall I've got loads of like uh, sheets of paper and they're really just my notes from uh, the books that I've read uh, and these are the books. So you can see a hell of a load of books. Um, yeah, let me just show you. Uh, so, one particular book that I read by a guy called Robert Kiyosaki, and it's called How to Retire Young and Retire Rich. And basically, I've just written down like the principles of what I learned from that book. And I'll give you guys, you know, examples. It just says uh, key points taken from Retire Young, Retire Rich. Number 14, your future is determined by what you do today, the people you hang around, the media you consume, the risks you take you don't, or you don't take. Your words and actions influence your reality. Number 15, raise capital instead of saving. Uh, saving is a slow concept and takes time, uh, which is a finite asset. Raise capital instead using other people's time and other people's money. So yeah, um, really, really opened my eyes and uh, changed my way of thinking. So that, that was pretty much uh, two thirds of my room. Um, the other sort of part of it is, you know, I've got a window here. It gives me an, an amazing view of the roadside. Um, so I can see all of the cars passing by and anyone's trying to do anything dodgy around my house. I know what's going down. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, everything else is pretty, you guys seen it. Apart from that, I'm, you know what? I'm probably just gonna chill out for the rest of the day, guys. It's like 3 p.m., nearly four. Maybe watch a movie. I don't know. I uh, haven't watched a movie in a while. Um, uh, probably, but to be honest, probably just gonna do a lot of reading and trying to sort of uh, find a few jobs to do. I've applied to be a freelancer on Fiverr recently. Um, so Fiverr is like an online uh, freelancing website where you can post jobs or you can, you know, do sort of uh, ad hoc jobs for other people around the world. It's a cool website. Check it out. If you want to make some sort of extra money um so yeah just trying to land my first gig on that website uh apart from that apart from that i'm probably just gonna try and chill out today um i think this quarantine has been a, a massive opportunity for uh for people who for, well for people to do things that they weren't able to do previously so if you were a person who was like working all the time and now your work for whatever reason has been closed or you know you know what you're working from home you got a lot more time to spend with your family or you got a lot more time to do things that you normally wouldn't be able to do like relax um i personally feel like that's the case with me i'm always running around doing stuff and with quarantine i feel like i've actually just uh you know had a chance to sort of um relax and you know um take it easy take a step back and just reflect on what i'm doing so definitely it's a good thing. Uh, it's one of the positives, um, you know, outside of people dying and stuff. So, apart from that, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, it's probably going to be quite long. I don't know how long it's going to be. <laughs> I need to edit it. And uh, I hope if you did enjoy it, uh, make sure to like, comment down any comments that you might have had, and uh, of course. Don't forget to subscribe uh, to my channel. Uh, I'm going to be bringing you guys more quarantine vlogs uh, in the next sort of few days and weeks coming. So definitely stay tuned for those. Um, other than that, I'm going to catch you guys in the next one.